Hi all, it's 13 September 2021 today. I'm going to touch on Chinese equities markets midday update. Is it a risk on or risk off day? Well, take a look. Below is an extract of what I did yesterday on the weekly update with regards to the Chinese equities market. I touched on Hansing Tech Index and I mentioned a few points, but today in focus will be two main points 6,600 points and 6,300 points. This morning, we see a big fall in Hansing Tech because of the news circling around Alibaba reported by the media. Just before lunch, it was trading at around 6,570 points. And I took a quick look earlier, it was around 6,545, 46. So the question to ask ourselves today is, we close above 6,600? Or we hit even lower to 6,300. Nobody really know, but it's important for me myself to actually observe how the market closed today. Like what I mentioned in my earlier slide, news reporting that there's intention for Alipay to be broken away for N Group. Wow, regulation overhand concerns. I'm sure the bears will bite on this opportunity and keep jumping on it. Wow, let's shot it, let's shot it. But to me, short selling Chinese equities at this price point may not be exactly that safe. And for me, I remain cautiously optimistic as long as the support levels are not broken. True enough that 6,600 points have been tested. True enough that it's right now below 6,600 points, around 6,500 plus points. But is it so worrying if you don't have any positions for parties, people who do not have any positions right now? It's time to think through. Is this a continuation of downtrend or is this a case of just a slight retracement when it's going on the way back? This is a Hansing index. Well, watch out for 225,700 support level and see whether it can close above these two levels, 25,700 and 26,000 points today. Of course, we see that right now is 25,600 plus points. But we never know. We have to watch for how the Europe markets open later and see whether we bring on a positive impact on the Asian markets. Well on the on the left you will see that um there's various equities that I pull up from my Tiger Brokers platform and on the right you will see the Shanghai index and Shenzhen index where Shanghai index was trading up above the three thousand seven hundred points Shenzhen index close to fourteen thousand seven hundred points apparently not severely impacted as compared to Hong Kong equities. Well, reason being like what I mentioned in a few of my videos that the best actually you typically use the Hong Kong equities and hunting index and hunting tech as a platform for them to leverage on their short positions. You see what I circled out, Meituan, Weibo, Alibaba, Bilibili, ZA Online, Tencent, all these are coming down hard by at least 3% and true enough bullet point one tech stock suffered today biting on the Alibaba news that the bear can bite on point two like what I mentioned Chinese markets are doing well for Shanghai and Shenzhen Shenzhen is still holding above 14,700 and for audience who have watched my a50 video, you see that A50 is still way above 15,000 points at around 15,500 points just now when I watch it. The point and point three, watch out for Billy Billy and Quite So Ted. Quite So Ted surprisingly performed relatively solid this morning. It was up slightly, but Xiaomi was a bit of concern. And whether can it hold above 23 Hong Kong dollar point is a critical point for me. Because right now, I'm not going to add on any more positions in Xiaomi since I have a decent position. And Xiaomi had to really find support here. And whether the 
company share buyback will help in stabilizing this price, but the close will be important. Let's watch out for it. Thoughts. Let's continue to watch out the support levels. Hansing tap I touched on earlier. Hansing I mentioned earlier. Question is, will this risk of mood be worrying? Will it last? For me, like what I mentioned, I will stay on the sidelines since I already have position, relatively decent positions. And is this an opportunity for others who have no positions at all? Well, fundamentally, as long as a company have good growth prospect and a solid business, and having a very decent balance sheet, it's a kind of opportunity. But bear in mind that there may be drawdown in terms of 10-20% if the support levels at 6,600 and 6,300 for Hansen Tech cannot hold. But thing for sure is I will stay out of Alibaba. As always, this should not be construed as any investment or trading advice. Thanks and have a good day.